What's up guys, this is Satya for Hyperclub. In this video, we're going to talk about how to edit or control what people see about you across Google services. So for this, you have to first log into your account, first sign into your account, use your login and password and click on the sign in button. So once you logged in, you have to go to aboutme.com google.com is a url name this url is uh, given in the description uh, category i can straight away click on that and open your respective uh, about me page so i'm going to use i'm going to open about me at google.com this will open this page of my google plus or google account so here you can see your name your picture and gender birth information normally so uh, uh, as far as google account or google services is concerned uh, whatever the name as well as the picture is uploaded uh, you cannot control that these two information whoever has uh, a google services account or google services uh, google plus account or google services they can go and see that on the other hand, you can control a um, whole lot of stuff which we are going to see uh, in the upcoming uh, uh, steps. First one is how to change the photograph. So you have the photographs already available. You can click on this photograph icon and we can update upload photo. Click on the upload photo one and you can select the photos from the library so once you select it from the library and you can click open and that gets set in there so i have only selected one here so yeah, i'm going to click the click picture and uh, here you can do a resizing by clicking and dragging the handles So once you are satisfied with your, uh, you know, cropping and resizing, you can click done option, which will change your uh, profile picture. So that's how you change your profile picture. And the next one comes how to change the names or the nicknames. Click on this edit option to the right side. So under the profile picture, you have first name and last name. You have nickname here you can give your nickname and uh, let's say i'm gonna uh, give a nickname called um, hype and tagline i'm gonna give uh, tech geek so this is the tagline i'm gonna give and you have option of how it's getting displayed the format of uh, getting displayed either you just need to display the first name and last name and you can include uh, the nickname in the middle or you can use a nickname in the uh, right extreme so you can choose any other option and uh, you can use that so you can click ok to save this option so in this case i don't want to do that i'm going to cancel i'm happy with the uh, name uh, we're going to move to the next one so how to edit your gender and date of birth and other information how to control those uh, things so click on the edit option under the second box click on this one and uh, first one is the gender option so uh, you can give there are four uh, options available uh, male female uh, the third one is if you don't want to state that you can choose the option decline to state and click ok so your general information will not be displayed in your profile if you go to the uh, last option custom option click on custom option and uh, you can uh, state a custom option gender there so if you see below that you know why google requires gender information so so that they can uh, customize the information depends upon the gender if you see here for example if the male is selected they'll customize the information like send him a message 
and if you select female here they'll change the information like send her a message if you select other they will change it to send them a message so that's how google customize those information using gender so here i'm going to select male as gender next one we'll move to data birth so data birth will be uh, shown here uh, you can click on the show year option which will display the year of birth in addition to your date and month of birth uh, if you deselect that this year of birth will uh, goes off it will not be displayed if you feel the date of birth or year of birth is wrong if you want to update that you can click on the i option here and you can edit the date of birth information from your account so once you are uh, done with that the next option is occupancy so click on the occupancy and whatever the occupancy you are currently having you can type that so i'm gonna give an example uh, like tech vlogger so i'm gonna give that as my occupancy once you given your occupancy you can just say okay so uh, which will updated in the uh, google account and this will be displayed so not only updating you can control those information uh, it means who are all going to see those information for example so here you have a uh, general information you can click on the lock button here to right side click on it there are multiple options available currently it is in private so this will not be uh, get displayed if you click on public so it will get displayed to all the people click on again and you can uh, choose to display to your circle only or otherwise you can choose to extended circles also or otherwise you can go to customs you can select certain circles so that they can access those particular information so you can do that as well the same thing applicable to the rest of the uh, options I mean gender uh, birthday and uh, occupancy also so it depends upon your requirement your wish you can customize this either private public your circle extended circle or custom so once you uh, or once you are okay with the the controlling part so how you will know that uh, the bank changes you made how this that's going to uh, reflect in your uh, profile uh, google account so that's the option we have go to this left extreme uh, option click on this and here you have a preview option click on the preview option so that will show what are the things those are getting displayed in your uh, account so based upon my um, guidelines whichever i've given google account will show this information so uh, this is how you edit and control your information in google account as well as google plus so you can leave your comment in the comment section and uh, thanks for your time